welcome to the channel guys we are out here been out here about three hours doing some work i'll spin you around and you can see what i've been up to i'm gonna turn it up on this tree yeah i tried everything to knock it down it's just got so many limbs holding it you're not gonna be able to do that and if you go in there see how that one's like a main support you were to cut that that thing would pop it's very very dangerous so i just been cutting it off started at the top i got a ladder went up there cut the end off and working my way down a little bit at a time so once you get these things cut up man there's not much to them you know cedar trees are pretty simple there's just a lot of limbs a lot of limbs but uh, a lot of you guys have never seen my view because this tree was down last spring and there's another one behind it also needs cut up and uh let me show you that ain't all i've been doing i hadn't been filming anything and then uh once i get all this out of here i'll cut this stump up better try to get this leveled back out got all this cleared out i still got a lot of limbs to pull out and i even went up in this corner and cut all that stuff out it just needs to be pulled out uh, if you remember or not there was a tree there i've cut that up as well so i have been busy man once all the sticks are picked up i forgot to buy me a rake today because i broke my rake but once it's all picked up i'm gonna get out that weed eater with that blade on it and knock all this down rake all this up real nice it's gonna look good so i'm gonna get back to it over there it's about 55 degrees it's nice and uh, uh i was gonna bring the truck over here i have a strap hooked up but it's too i can't get through here with the truck <laughs> not with libby out anyway uh and to go around that way it, it's too muddy so it would get it wouldn't get stuck but it would make some big ruts so uh, it doesn't matter i got it we are on top of it now I, I just can't wait till this is down and out of the way and i get my view back and that cedar tree is going to need quite a bit of trimming i'll have to get the pole saws and all that out uh, i want to get all this done before summer you know this is the perfect time to do this stuff so all right let me get busy <laughs> You guys do not have one of these still battery powered chainsaws, man. You need one. Yeah. 
Put the bionic man Holding this is this limb here. So I gotta clear up, get up in there. I wanna be in front of it. Thinks I'm a little lazy. I think she's a little crazy. We like summer and we like spring. Watching wrestling in the rain. She ain't shy, she speaks her mind. Tough as nails and smooth as wine. We burn hot as kerosene. Baby, we got our own thing. She ain't skinny and I ain't tall. And that don't bother us at all. I run naked through the yard. She flashed every police car, drinking wine and getting tired, and shooting out the damn street lights. How does she put up with me? Oh, baby, we got our own thing. We got our own thing. We don't need no rain. We ain't rich, but son of a. We're a hillbilly king and queen. Life don't seem so hard with you beneath the stars. Cause we're growing four leaf clovers in the yard There ain't nothing that he can't fix He's a hard-headed son of a We got married on the Georgian line Watch out ladies, this one is mine He works hard and just don't quit Even if his pants don't fit Lord, he'll be the death of me Baby, we've got our own thing We eat good like you ought to do Mashed potatoes and All right, I got a big chunk of that cleaned up already. I'll be get, able to get to that back tree uh, pretty soon once I get a lot of these cleared out of here. That one's not going to be nothing. Uh, it's pretty small. But that's going to be quite the fire. Two of them. Got one out front. This is just from two storms. Well, maybe three. One last spring and then the two winter ones we got. That's why them trees went down. Uh, and there's that, guys. But that tree's dead now. That's an oak tree. That has to come down. That was in the fire when I had the fire out here. All this burnt down. And you can see that part almost fell off and killed me when we had the fire. I was out here putting out spot fires and that thing decided it was going to break off. And that one lived on for another, I think it died last spring. Lived on another five, six years. But this one here is dead as well. In fact, I think I'm going to take this whole group of uh, oak trees out. That's a dead pine. That's got to come down. I'm going to take that little tree there down, open all this up. And I've got a dead pine back in there. Several other trees I'm going to take out. Uh, you know, I'm 57 years old, so I don't want to be playing with this crap when I'm 67 or 77. So the ones that are trouble, I'm going to get rid of. And there's several in there that need to be thinned out. Some of them are never going to be healthy trees because they're too close to the bigger ones. And there's a cedar that also needs to come down. So but I just don't want to overwhelm myself and go chopping it on everything right now. now. I've got these two to clean up. I thought there was three. Yeah, there's another one back there too. Uh, then I'm gonna fall that big pine tree right towards where this camera is. And that's gonna be pretty easy. There's not much, not much limbs on that. Pine beetles got that one. 
Oh man, that's a job. I've already been at it about four hours now. Look, we're starting to, starting to look better. I ain't gonna do a long video today, guys. I wasn't gonna do one at all. I said, well, everybody's been looking at that tree. So by tomorrow, uh, I should have that one down. And uh, we're gonna call it a day on this. Whew. That is, that, and that cedar is heavy stuff. And uh, if you're gonna comment why I don't turn this into lumber, I don't need lumber. I don't need any lumber. There is so much of this laying around around here. You know, <laughs> what am I gonna do with it? I'm gonna burn it for fire, fire pit wood. That's what I'm gonna do. Now this, this piece I'm not gonna cut. Well, I cut it there and I cut it there. That can get, he can take that, if he ever comes to get them trees, he can take that and mill it up. I don't want it. It do, does me a favor, but I'm not gonna let it go to waste. And then hopefully, we get in here. Well, I got limbs down in there too. Get in here and haul off all this junk. That's what I'm gonna do. All right, let's go look at the puppies, guys. What are you doing over here in this corner, sitting in your little biscuit, making all this noise? Uh, all right, we're gonna go in. See if we can't get puppies. What are you two up to? Yeah, I don't believe you. I don't believe you a bit. There were no giant roaches out here. Well, you always can't you change your story up a little, boy? Just a little. All right. Oh, it got pretty cold in here last night. It got down to well, about 45. But I put them towels around where those screens were, closed it in. I didn't hear no squeaking. So let's, let me get this flashlight on, guys, and get down there. I know they're all good because I looked at them. Mamas are good at taking care of their babies. I don't know if we're going to be able to get to see them. Oh, can I get a peek at the babies? Uh, well, let me get the light right, guys. There's some babies in there. They're all busy. <laughs> My shadow keeps getting in the way. Well, I Guys, they're gonna be a little bigger here pretty soon. They're gonna grow like weeds. We're gonna have plenty of pictures of the babies, so I don't wanna mess with them right now. Uh, did hear them. I think they wake up like four in the morning, go nuts for a while, and then they're good, but man, I ain't looking forward to when the little buggers are running around, tearing on everything. Uh, at least I know they can't get out because they got the but I am gonna get some more of this stuff out of here and make sure that the power cords are not in their reach. And, but we, the rest of the nights now are gonna be warm. I think we had our coldest day for a while. So I'm wore out guys. Just thought I'd put a little short one up. No big, no big thing. We're gonna have a lot of puppy content coming. So you will see that later. Happy trails. Puppy dogs, puppy dogs. And I gotta get in there and get them out of there once she feeds tonight. And I'm gonna put new clean bedding in this one, swap them out. That's what's nice about having two of them. And then uh, when they get bigger, I can zip them up in there, put three in there, three in there, so they're not as crazy. All right, guys, later.